Chronic myelogenous leukemia. Chronic myelogenous leukemia, CML, is a chronic myeloid proliferative disorder characterized by the massive overproduction of myeloid cells. The cells retain most of their function until later in the course of the disease. Although the Philadelphia chromosome is characteristic of the disease, the cause of the production of this chromosome is unknown. It is a clonal disorder of myelocytes. The Philadelphia chromosome is a translocation between chromosomes 9 and 22, resulting in a gene producing an enzyme with tyrosine kinase activity. 5% of cases are Philadelphia chromosome negative. Presentation. Look for a patient with a persistently high WBC count that is all neutrophils. Pruritus is common after hot baths, showers from histamine release from basophils. Splenomegaly presents with early satiety, abdominal fullness, and left upper quadrant pain. Chronic myelogenous leukemia, CML, can present with vague symptoms of fatigue, night sweats, and fever from hypermetabolic syndrome. CML can present with high WBC on routine exam. Diagnostic tests. After the high neutrophil count is found, you must determine if it is a reaction to another infection or stress, leukemoid reaction, or genuinely represents leukemia. The most accurate test, BCRABL, which can be done by PCR or FISH, fluorescent in situ hybridization, on peripheral blood. In CML, you may find small numbers of blasts, but it should be under 5%. Basophils are increased. Treatment. Tyrosine kinase inhibitors such as imatinib, Gleevec, dasatinib, or nilotinib are the best initial therapy. Only a bone marrow transplant can cure CML, but this should never be the first therapy. CML has the greatest likelihood of all myeloid proliferative disorders to transform into acute leukemia, blast crisis. If CML is untreated, this will happen in 20% of patients a year.